Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Philip Fowler with Anti-Aging Northwest. Uh, I want to go over tonight how to reconstitute your HCG. So if you've received HCG, it came in a package that looked something like this right here. And um, inside the box, you're going to find two things. You're going to find a vial of bacteriostatic water. And you're going to find a vial of your HCG powder. 4,000 units will be the amount of powder that's in there. And so to make a 1,000 unit per milliliter solution, we're going to add four milliliters of the bacteriostatic water to the powder. One quick thing to remember, kind of important, inside of the vial with the powder, there is a very strong vacuum. And if we just go straight in, it's gonna suck the fluid in very quickly and we're gonna power wash the power on the bottom. So we're gonna go over a very special way to hold the plunger and angle the syringe so that the, the water hits the side wall of the glass vial before it hits the powder. This way we're being very gentle with our, pep, with our peptide. So you'll also need a five milliliter, I believe it's an 18 gauge syringe. You should have received these in your package. So you should have probably three of these. They're the ones that look scary and don't wanna go in your leg. Okay, so we'll go ahead and open that. First thing we always do when we get a syringe like this in our hand with a removable needle tip is we're gonna go ahead and tighten that. Okay, now we're gonna take our bacteriostatic water and we're gonna go ahead and pop the lid off. And we're gonna take the lid off of our five milliliter syringe. We need a alcohol wipe. And we're gonna go, gonna go ahead and clean the top of the bacteriostatic water vial just like that. Now we can go in here, just carefully right through the middle of the rubber stopper, just like that. Turn the whole situation upside down and we want four mils. So as you can see here, we've got a five milliliter syringe. We're gonna draw back to the four ml mark. Let me get a little closer look. And that's perfect. One question I hear a lot is which part of that black piece do I measure with? So with this, with with the syringe facing, so the needle's pointing to the ceiling, you wanna measure with the top of the black part of the plunger where it meets the wall of the syringe. The top of the black part of the plunger where it meets the wall of the syringe, put that right on the line that you want, in this case, the number four. I'm not sure how well you can see that. But we're pretty spot on there. So we've got our four mils of solution. Now we're gonna take our vial of powder. We're gonna take off that little cap and we're gonna again clean the top. Now comes the time when we're gonna carefully, we're gonna hold on to the plunger up here and we're gonna not allow the plunger to go down, right? We're gonna squeeze the plunger because if we just go straight in without doing that, the plunger's gonna go down very quickly and we're gonna power wash all those delicate peptides on the bottom. It's not tragic if it happens, but it's ideal if we don't let that happen. So squeezing the plunger, preventing it from going down, we're gonna carefully go right through the middle of the, it's already pulling it. I'm squeezing as hard as I can almost with my fingers. And then we're gonna angle over towards the glass wall and we're just gonna let that plunger down very, very slowly. Hard to see, I know. Let the plunger down slowly. Go ahead and pull your syringe out. This can go directly in your sharps container. And now what we've got is a four mil vial of solution. We never shake HCG because it is a delicate peptide. So we're gonna turn it upside down and we're gonna swirl just like that. I usually swirl for about 30 seconds. Your HCG injection dose is usually going to be 0 0.5 milliliters per injection. You'll be using a syringe that'll look like this. And on this syringe, 0 0.5 milliliters, this is a one mil syringe. 0.5 milliliters will be to the 50 mark. This is a one mil syringe marked in, in 100 units. So to get a half mil, we're gonna go to the 50 mark. All right, thank you so much. I hope that's very helpful to you. If you have questions, please reach out to us. We always want you injecting confidently and safely. Um, and always stop by our website, antiagingnorthwest.com. Thank you so much.